seconds of the car. Slow and they're not coming into the dial-up. Teams with a big challenge, they need an identity. Trust is the underlying foundation to be able to work together successfully. There's a very famous German sociologist, Niklas Luhmann, who brought it to the point. He said, trust reduces complexity. If you have not that much trust, there's much more controlling needed. And controlling needs time. It's expensive and it takes away a lot of motivation. That's the fascinating thing about trust. You can't see it, smell it, it's hard to measure. It has such a tremendous impact on the economics of teams. So you have to get the team, build up the infrastructure, build the boats. That's the collaboration phase. I will focus on the cooperation phase, the cycle of winning those 65 races in the actual America's Cup. True pride doesn't come from money, power, or status. It comes from competence, being good at something and delivering a performance, making a difference. We didn't want to dream about our success. We wanted to make the most out of our potential. We understood ourselves as a learning organization. We understood in this team, the social interactions are important. How we communicate, how we create membership, living by example. You can't show up, put a lot of money on the table and think you're gonna win it. Loser's mentality basically means to complain about the bad weather. You know, the winds were shifting too strong, big waves, raining, cold, whatever. I mean, the winner who finished the race 10 meters in front of you had exactly the same weather conditions. Winner's mentality means make the most out of those difficult conditions and always focus on what you can improve yourself. Yeah.